Hi, y'all. I just got back from town a little while ago. Me and Claire went to town. We went to Dollar Tree, and I got a bunch of stuff that I could use for my pre resin projects. Cheaper than anywhere you can get online. Look at these sparkly things, and these are lightweight. They won't just go right to the bottom of your resin. And look at these sparkly diamonds. Beautiful, sparkly diamonds. Red, white, and blue confetti. There's some glitter. And there's some uh, keychain things. And this is some real fine Real fine glitter. Real fine. And bought this thing, paper organizer. I bought it to, when I get some resin, get some things poured up, put them on this and use it for a tray to go set them wherever I want to set them. They set on this and not, and I, not drip all over them everywhere. And put old catalogs or paper of some kind on here and keep this clean. Use it like a tray, in other words. And got a whole bag of marbles. You ain't gonna get them no cheaper than Dollar Tree. Of course, they're all blue, bluish. Here's a purple one in there. Some are clear. There's blue, blue, green, green. And, uh, oh, I've got this to put in the bottom of the little fish tanks. I'm going to make some little fishy, fish bowl, fishy things, like I've seen other people do on, uh, on their videos. Get a hold of this and move it out of the way. And I've got these little little miniature beads. It's what they are, they have alphabet letters on them. I thought, well, I could probably use them in some of the jewelry making. And you want to talk about getting some cheap holograph for your resin? Look at that. At Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree. These are gift bags, but so what? You can still use them. And I'm going to. Look at that. that here's a, this. Look at that. Ain't that pretty? This. Look you there. Look at this glittery. Let me show you this side of it. Glittery. There's six bags in each package, so I ain't gonna run out no time soon. And here's red glittery. And more that gold glittery. And a green glittery. So I got this stacked up, and here's some more. Mm. 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 What's this? Oh, these are stickers. Look at these stickers. I can use these, put these on some of the resin things. Sure can. And there's candy ones, they're candies. Sure can. And, baby. Now, look at these lightweight glittery things. Tube confetti, you can use this in them. Lightweight and they won't sink to the bottom of your resin mold. 
sequins, now they will. But you can still use sequins however you want to use them. Glitteries. What's this? Look at those sequins. A spritzer bottles, that way I put some alcohol in a spritzer bottle to spritz for them bubbles. That's what I got them for. And here's one of the two things I got to make the little fish bowls with. See there? I can hardly wait. Get that price tag off of there. Well, had the price tag stuck on there. I'll have to Got it all. There it is. Ain't that pretty? It's gonna make a pretty little fish bowl. Get out of that. Another fish bowl. And uh, clear nail polish. And that's to paint over the eyes of the skulls, make them shine, make them real shiny or whatever. You want to paint over to make it extra shiny. Another little thing of those sparkly diamonds. These would be pretty in some of that jewelry. Jewelry. Little spoons to stir the resin with. Beautiful sequins. Um, and this is a sharpie to mark my measuring cups because can't hardly see what the little lines are. And, what not, you have to mark them with a, one of these. And cups to mix it with stuff in. Cups, cups. Put the spoons in there with that. Oh, there's more down here at my feet. I saved these bags we use them in our small trash bags, trash cans around the house. Uh, move these. There we go. I am excited. Now I need to get some more. Um, Raisin goes fast. Now I got these paper clips. Yeah, paper clips. Whenever you do something that's got something that's big for a wall hanging, while the resin, uh, after you pour that resin, it starts getting hard to stick one of these uh, paper clips in there with part of it, a little of it sticking up in the back where they hang it on a hook or a nail or something. They can then hang it on the wall. That's how they did stuff. I remember stuff from back in the 50s and 60s whenever they'd do uh, plaster crafts. That's how they would do when the plaster was still wet or whatever pliable. They would stick those little U-shaped things in them and when the plaster dried on the ends of it, you know, in the back it still had this 
little hook thing sticking up here. You can put them right on the ball on the nail or something. Okay, I got some toys. Oh, I got some toys because I want to do some kid stuff. So, I have stuff to sell that's not just for grown-ups, but for kids. Look at there. Put these in some stuff. Come on out of there. Two little Hot Wheel cars. Oh, I like this one. Now, this will appeal to people who grew up in the 70s, people who were teenagers in the 70s. Wait till you see this. 1970s band. Look at that. 1970s band. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty cool. I got that fish. I like that fish, it's cute. Seems to be pretty much stuck on that. Looks like a wave. I don't know. This kind of a fish don't jump out of water. These stay in the water. But it's still usable. And looky here. Roar. Roar. A lion. A lion. Make like a little platter, a little something like it, and put this lion on there. That could be neat. Where's them scissors at? Tags off. I hate tags. I hate tags. Now, where's my markers? That's pretty neat. And then, here's one I like. The ele elephant. Pretty neat, huh? That's gonna be really neat. Elephant. Put that on something. A person could use it to put their hanger rings on it. <laughs> and there's there's the bill. Dinosaur, dinosaur, pretty neat, huh? Pretty neat, to use it for a ring hanger, older, <laughs> or whatever, okay. Go ahead, get 
get things in the ash. Pretty neat, huh? I like them. And I think little boys will like them too. Oh, let me see this one. A dolphin. How about that? Realistic looking dolphin. That's going to be neat. Way over some kind of orca, maybe. No, it don't have that big fin on top of it. I don't know. Some kind of a whale. That'll be neat and something. It'll be neato and something. And. Pretty neat, huh? I like this one. Uh, you can put your rings on this one, just put them right on there. Tape. We're always using them. See if I can get that dang old tag thing off. Here it comes. Big old nasty fly. <laughs> Big old nasty fly. <laughs> I better, I'd, I'd like to put that in a skull, but it's, it's too wide. Unless if I put it in there sideways. Big old nasty fly. And I got this doll with the idea of using her to make a mold. Well, these days I want to get some of that silicon mold kit and uh, use her to make a mold. Maybe a ring holder mold, maybe. But, uh, you know, we'll see. We'll see. I guess that's all of it there. I guess that's all of it. Claire 
Claire bought me a thing of black licorice because we both like black licorice. <laughs> and I bought her a little notebook. She was looking for one. She said she couldn't find one, so I got her one. I got her some little tea lights, the kind you turn on, have a little tiny battery in them. Guess I'll open this up and start having one. I'm so tired. I wanted to try to do a little resin today, but I ain't going to. I, I was wanting to do a load of laundry, but I don't know if I'll get to it. I'm so tired. I just go to one place in town and it just wipes me out. Well, we went to Subway after that. I'd stand there in line waiting for a sandwich to get done. Then we stopped at Sonic and got a cherry limeade. After that, I was tired out, and I'm still tired out. I was tired out last night when I went to bed, and I didn't do hardly nothing yesterday. It don't take much. It's a good. Claire mentioned that these candies and Twizzler candy liquors. It don't taste as good as it used to. It's hard to find licorice candy that tastes as good as it used to years ago. I she's right. I've always liked black licorice. They don't, don't have as much flavor as it used to. I will know when it will sure will. Something to know. Mm. Well, that's it for now, y'all. I'm tired. Look at my mess over here. That's my resin making mess, and that's stuff over there. And I've got resin stuff making stuff over there. So. Oh. I'm not interested in crocheting right now. I just want to do resin. Well, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.